Mm, hello again. In this video, I want to talk about the state equation in Petronet. So, in the last video, we have seen how to how to get the incidence metric of a given Petronet. Okay. So, in this video, I will talk about the state equation. Okay. So, here, imagine. Uh, just let me talk about something here. Okay. Here, th this this is the marking. Let's 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 see that. Let's say that this is the initial marking of this picture. Net. I have so that's P one, P two, and P three, and P four. The transitions I have T one, T two, and T three, and that's the incid the incidence metric of this. So the initial marking here is 2, 0, 0 token in P3, and 1 token in P4. The incidence matrix here, for example, for T1, for T1, when I fire T1, so I remove a token from P1, and I, I deliver, or I put a token in P2 and 1 token in P3, and zero token in P4. For example, from this and from this this uh, marking, T1 is uh, fireable. Okay, when I fire t T1, that's mean I add this row here to this uh, marking. So that's mean minus one plus two is one. One plus zero, one. One plus zero, one. Zero plus one, one. And when I fire this, so I remove this and I add it here. Okay. For example, from this, from this, uh, I can fire. Uh, yes, I can fire T two. What's that mean from this? So this T two here in the incidence matrix. When I fire T two, so I don't. Uh, uh, I don't <coughs> delete or add any token to P1. The same thing for P2. I just remove a token from P3 and I, I add a token from P4. So when I add this to this row here, so 1 plus 0 so is 1, and 1 plus 0 is 1, and 1 plus minus 1 is 0, and 1 plus 1 is 2. And here, so from this marking, from this, when I fire T2 here in the network, so here when I fire T2, so I remove this token, and I remove this token, because that's input and that's input, so, and I put a token here, and I put a token here. So I get 1, 1, 0, 2, and that's 3. Okay. So uh, let's see now the state equation. So our initial marking here, so 2, 0, 0, 1. So from this marking, if I add, if I want to know, if I want to see the marking after I ran to 1 from this marking, so here I just move add this marking, the initial marking, the current marking. So this vector, so I have three transitions. So I have, I want to see this, this marking, what's happened, what's the next marking when I fire T1 one time. I just fire T1 one time. Okay. So here, one, Zero, 0 because I want to fire what T1. Okay. I multiplicate this vector here by the incidence matrix. So this vector times this. We can we can multiplicate it because here I have uh, three columns and here I have three rows. If you multiplicate this by this uh, matrix here, you get minus one. Uh, one, one, zero. So this vector times this. So when I add this to this new vector here, 
So 2 plus minus 1 is 1. Uh, 1 plus 0, 1. 1 plus 0, 1. And 0 plus 1, 1. Okay. For example, for example, if I want to if I want to see with the marking after so from this marking, if I ran T1 two times, so here I just write two. Okay. Here I must have just so uh, just only one non-zero number here in this vector. So I I want to see the marking after this when I fire T1 two times. So the first represent T1 and the second rep represent T2 and the third represent T3. So if I multiplicate this by this uh, matrix, so you will get minus 2, excuse me, yes, minus 2, 2, 2, 0. This time is this is equal to this. So this vector, this marking plus this marking is equal to 0, 2, 2 plus 0, 2, 0 plus 1, 1. That's what means the state equation. Okay? So that's it. I hope that you like this video and I hope that you subscribe to my channel. And if you have any remark, just put it in the comments below. And if if you have, I, if you excuse me, if you have any problem, just uh, put your question below also. And see you later.